All right, guys, this uh, will be a short video since it's just a follow up on my latest video that you can find in the card right here or just in the description below. And uh, well, I cut it short. I tested the Intel i9 with uh, the Apex motherboard with the Radeon RX 6800 XT and smart access memory. Since uh, a lot of you ask about that and I found the right BIOS, I tested it. So I will revisit all the slides uh, that I showed you in the past video that uh, I there I got more in depth. So uh, if you didn't see that already, uh, check it out before so you can see the detailed description of what is the test was all about and then you can check this one. So let's get to it and let's see what this uh, smart access memory on Intel looks like. The first thing we saw in my past video is that uh, both the Intel i9 10900K overclocked and the AMD Ryzen with a good memory tuning can really make a GPU shine, so they are both extremely good CPU. With that said, I colored in purple the two results that are relevant for the video of today. And it's pretty easy to read the, the chart since there's only one FPS of difference and two FPS in the 1% lows. I tried a lot of time, like five, six, seven times uh, to make sure that I was not doing anything wrong. But yes, in this title, basically there's no change. Same thing for the ray tracing benchmark, absolutely no change at all. What can I say? Even in Far Cry New Dawn, we have the same exact result, uh, one FPS more in the 1% low, but uh, well, is within the range of variance, so no improvement. In Red Dead Redemption 2, we see even a decrease in performance. And a curious thing is, uh, if I have an AMD CPU, so an AMD platform, and uh, I enable smart access memory with an NVIDIA GPU, we see a decrease in performance there as well. And again, if I have an Intel CPU, Intel system, with smart access memory enabled and an NVIDIA GPU, again, I have a decrease in performance. And guess what? In Godfall, same story. So one FPS improvement and the 1% uh, lows are actually worse by even five FPS. So, so yeah, this thing doesn't really looks good. In World of Warcraft, we have the same behavior again. And uh, well, I really hope that is something that they need to develop more since uh, the results are really off. But here at the end, in the ray tracing benchmark for World of Warcraft, we have four FPS of improvement. I think we have to celebrate and maybe there's hope. What do you guys think? All right, as you just saw, it seems that uh, this feature is not uh, ready yet and I don't know if it's an early BIOS issue, uh, if it's related to the PCI Express 4.0 that uh, is not supported on Intel yet, uh, I don't know, but uh, I will keep it on check and for sure I will let you know if something changed, if uh, the numbers are more worthy to evaluate this match so for now, uh, my suggestion is do not mix uh, an Intel CPU with uh, an AMD Radeon GPU since uh, you can do it, it works, but if you can find a better, a better way to, to prepare your build, like an Intel CPU and an Nvidia card, or uh, like an AMD CPU and an Nvidia card, or an AMD GPU. But Intel AMD doesn't not quite works right now. Uh, I hope that the thing is going to change in the future so you can uh, pick uh, what is best uh, without worrying too much of uh, intercompatibility, if we can call it like that. Okay, so uh, as you can see I have a nice thing right here and uh, well, no secret, this is uh, our EK water block for the monster right here. Or maybe uh, by the time you are going to see this video, I'm fighting with the F5, so I'm going to refresh a lot my web browser, looking to buy a Nerex 5900 XT and put the beast uh, with this. But uh, who knows? Let's see if I can again win the F5 game. I will let you know soon enough. So for today is everything, as always join my Discord server, if you have any question you can ask me whatever you want, DM me, no issue, and well you can write down below in the comment section, uh, what, what else, usual stuff. 
subscribe if you like it uh, to see more updates on this like the video dislike the video do whatever you want whatever you feel right and see you in the next one